almost 50 years before an effective general anesthetic was available in the West. It was used by physician Seishu Hanaoka in Japan. Combining traditional Chinese medicine with European methods of surgery, he carried out the world's first treatment of breast cancer under general anesthetic in 1804. This was the first documented use of general anesthesia in the world, and precedes William Morton's use of ether gas anesthesia at the Massachusetts General Hospital in 1846. Japanese surgeons traditionally followed the Chinese medical tenet of limiting harm and consequently avoided invasive surgical procedures. In contrast, amputations and surgeries were being routinely performed in Europe without anesthetic. Sometimes opium and alcohol were used to dull the agony, but Western surgeons hadn't yet found an effective way to eliminate pain during operations. Hanaoka, however, saw great potential in combining the best of both medical worlds. He was determined to save women from breast cancer using Western surgical techniques, but he also felt it was his duty to prevent pain and harm. It took Hanaoka 20 years of experimentation to create the right anesthetic formula using a combination of drugs derived from extremely poisonous plants used in Chinese medicine. Indeed, when he believed he'd arrived at a safe dose, he tested it on his wife. Tragically, he had miscalculated the mixture, and his wife went blind as a result. However, Hanaoka persisted and found an effective combination made up of angel's trumpet and Japanese monk's foot. The active ingredients in this formula were atropine and scopolamine, substances which are still used today as sedatives and muscle relaxants. Hanaoka went on to perform over 150 breast cancer surgeries in Japan and is now widely considered to be the father of anesthesia.